Mikey, I'm out of ideas. What should we do? Hmm, I don't know either. I think we did everything we could. We fulfilled all the villagers' orders. Hmm. Yeah, Mikey, I guess you're right. We need to find something to keep us busy. I've still got a lot of energy. We need to find some adventure. Let's walk around the village, see if we can find something interesting. Maybe we'll find the monster. I want to fight someone. Or maybe we could go to the mine. No, Mikey, this is boring. We've done it all before. We have to find something new. Let's keep going. Maybe we'll find something. I want an interesting adventure. I think I found something. Let's see what it is. It looks like a, a bone. <gasps> what? What's this bone doing here? I think it's here for a reason. Maybe it's a sign. Maybe there's something hidden underneath. Maybe it's a treasure. Mikey, dig up the blocks around here. Ah! Wow, what's that? Blood. But why is it hanging there when you're breaking blocks? This is so weird. I guess I was right and it's an unusual bone, which means we found an adventure. <laughs> I want to know where this bone here came from. There's a lot of blocks to break. I'm using TNT. I think I can blow up the blocks and we'll find out what this bone is hiding. Hopefully there'll be some expensive treasures in there. Light it up. Now we've got to get away. TNT can't hurt us. Mikey, be careful. The explosion is very dangerous. Whoo, TNT exploded, which means we're about to find out what's inside. I hope there's no blood this time. It gets in the way and makes it hard to see. There's blood again. Oh no, this is terrible news. Because of the blood, we can't see what's hidden underneath. Since the blood shows up anyway, we need to find a way to remove it. We need someone to drink all that blood. Hmm, Mikey, I have an idea. Run down to the village and get some villagers. They'll drink all the blood so it won't reappear and we'll see what's in that pit. Run to the village. I'll wait for you here. I think this way will work. Mikey went to the village, which means I have to wait for him here. I really hope the villagers can drink a lot of blood and it won't bother us anymore. I'm so curious to know what this blood means and why there is blood here when we destroy blocks. I hope after villagers we can find out what is here. I think we're in for something amazing. Could it be some kind of ancient artifact or a weapon? Hmm, we'll find out soon enough. It won't be long now because Mikey's on his way here with the villagers. Hey, Mikey, I see you've succeeded in finding villagers for our purposes. Hello, villagers. We have a mission for you. You must complete it and then we'll give you lots of emeralds. We found the bones and it sparks blood. You need to drink all this blood so we can see what's in the pit. All right, now we're gonna do it. I hope you'll give us lots of emeralds for this task. Yes, we'll pay you well, but we'll do it later. When you've drunk all the blood, we'll see what's in here. When we're done, we'll go back to the village and give you each a stack of emeralds. You need to drink all the blood. There won't be a single drop inside the pit. Oh my God, I've had so much to drink. My head is so big and red now. It's horrible. It's hard to hold my head up. I can't drink anymore. If I drink anymore, I'll explode. So I think I've had enough. Look, my friends finished. We've completed your mission. I hope you didn't cheat us and pay us later. We'll be waiting for you in the village. We're waiting for our emeralds. All right, don't worry. Everything will be fine. You'll just have to wait for us for a while. And the best thing for you to do is to see a doctor. JJ, I'll give him the emeralds now. I took them specifically to pay them now. Wow, all right, Mikey. Then here are your emeralds. Don't forget to give half to your friend. Thanks for helping us out. Now get to the doctor. Okay, thanks for the emeralds. If you need my help, I'm always available. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, villager. Mikey, there's no blood in the pit now, which means now we can see what's inside it. I hope it's something cool. Let's not waste any more time in case the blood shows up again. Let's go see what's in there. Whoa, it's a scary villager. But what's he doing here? He seems to have been buried here for some reason. Well, what's that strange sound? Do you hear it? No! Mikey! Yeah. Oh my God, my head. I hit it hard after the fall, but where did we hit? 
Mikey, get up! I think we're in some kind of cage. It's horrible. That scary villager was bait and lured us into a scary villager's trap. I'm so scared. I don't want to die. I think we're in a terrible trap. Let's not waste time for nothing. Someone might see us and then we'll be in trouble. Let's get out of this cage. There's a door, but I see a lock on it. Yes, you can't open it without a key. Looks like we need to find the key to this lock to get out of this cage. We shouldn't make any noise while we're in here. Look, JJ, there's a dog standing there with a key in its mouth. We've got to figure out a way to get that key out of his mouth. Do you have any ideas? Yes, we're gonna need to lure the dog with a bone. But first, we need to get that bone. To do that, use TNT to blow up the passage to the top. There will be the body of a scary villager. It will fall into our cage and we can get the bone out of his body. Then the dog will come to us. Put on the TNT and light it up. I hope no one comes to us after that sound. It exploded. That's great. The scary villager has fallen to us. Now you have to get one bone out of him. Use your sword to get it out easier. Hopefully the dog will come to us and give us that key. All right, now I'm gonna try to do it. I don't think it's gonna be that hard. Mikey, hurry up and finish it. JJ, I'm done. I got the bone out of him. All right, come to the dog and wave the bone. He should see it and wanna come over here. All right, the dog spotted you. Now throw it a bone. He'll have to drop the key to get the bone in his mouth. I think she's going to drop the key. All right, Mikey, the key is now lying by our door, but we have to find a way to get it now. I can't reach it with my hand. So I got an idea. I'm gonna try to find the resources to make a fishing rod. It can pick up objects and I'll get the key out. All right, Mikey, now I have all the resources to make a crafting table and fishing rod. Now I'm going to make a fishing rod and try to get the key out. All right, the fishing rod is ready. Now I have to try to get the key so I can pick it up. That's hard enough. I don't have much room to cast the rod, but I think I can do it. The key is so close to our cage. I have to cast it a couple more times. I can do it now. All right, Mikey, I got the key. That means we can open the door and get out of this cage. Let's not stay here too long. Let's get out of this cage. We've got to see where we are and find a way out before somebody kills us. Mikey, now I know where we are. We're in an underground scary village. It's horrible. I think we should be careful not to let anyone see us. Ah! Oh no! Mikey, there's a scary villager after us. We need to find a place to hide. There's a lot of them out there. Mikey, keep moving. We need to run into the house and barricade the entrance. Hurry. Get in that house. Mikey, when I get in, block the door. Scary villagers can't get in. Oh no, the situation is dire. Apparently the whole scary village knows about us now. When they get here, a locked door won't save us. We need to rest after our escape and get out of this house before the scary villagers come back to us. I so wanted an adventure, but this adventure is incredibly scary and dangerous. Now we will rest for a while, and when the scary villagers move away from our house, we will get out of here and go looking for a way to escape. We need to either find a way out or destroy this scary village. We have to tell all the scary villagers about what happened. Hurry up and follow me. Hello to all the scary villagers. We have terrible news. Our village has been found by ordinary people. All follow me. Look, these people got into our scary village by squeezing a hole in the ceiling. But I have an idea. Now that we have a way out of here, let's go to the surface and find the village. We could eat all the regular villagers and we'll steal all their stuff to improve our scary village. Hurry, we must all go upstairs. There's finally some good food waiting for us. Then we'll go back and kill those people in our village, or our guards will deal with them. Let's go to the normal village. We're gonna kill everyone in there. Mikey, seems a lot of scary villagers have left the village. This is our chance to destroy her. But first, we need to become scary too. It's necessary for the other scary villagers to think that we are their friends. The cemetery will help us become scary. We just need to jump into one of these scary villagers. Great! Mikey already did it. Now it's my turn to be scary. I hope it works. Bam! I'm scary too now. Someone's coming over. Hey, 
What's the noise here? I heard there were people out there. You didn't see them. No, there was nobody here. Who, Mikey? We were lucky. <laughs> now they think we're the same scary villagers. That's cool. We can explore this village safely. No one will recognize us. Look, Mikey, it's TNT. Woohoo! We found their stash. We were very lucky. There is so much TNT. We have enough to bomb the whole scary village. We are lucky that now a lot of scary villagers have left the village. It means we have time to mine everything here and blow up the whole village. Then, we have to catch the last scary villagers and kill them. We must get all the TNT out of this building as soon as possible and start mining. Maybe scary villagers will come back and see us blowing up. I think they'll get really angry and attack us. Now I have to put all the TNT I got across the whole scary village so that the explosion was as strong as possible and hit as many houses as possible. My main task now is to destroy this place so that no one else will ever live here. Then the scary villagers will never come back here again and they won't have a place to live. Great, not so many houses left to mine. Soon you can start to explode. This explosion will be incredibly spectacular and unbelievable. The most important thing is not to get hit by a shockwave. Such a quantity of TNT can seriously harm us. Uh-oh. Mikey, what did you do? I didn't want to blow up the TNT yet. <laughs> it was so beautiful. Sorry, JJ, but I couldn't wait to blow up the whole thing. But the explosion was very spectacular, and I must have enjoyed watching it. Okay. Now don't bother me, Mikey. I need to spend all the TNT and blow up the rest of the house. This is their main house. When it explodes, all their resources will be destroyed. The village is already in complete ruin, and this house will be the last straw. Then we have to go up and kill all the angry, scary villagers. Uh oh That's it. It's time to wait for TNT and get out of this scary village. We have to protect our villagers. I'm waiting for TNT. There's going to be a huge explosion. Hmm. Wow, it's so beautiful. I love watching something explode. The explosion is over. I need to climb to the surface. Mikey, look. It's scary villagers from the scary village. We need to kill them before they hurt our village. Hurry up and chase them. Hey, you, scary villagers. I have great news for you. Your village has been completely destroyed. There are no houses left. All resources are gone. You have nowhere to run anymore. Great, all the scary villagers are defeated. Now we need to be cured. I want to become normal again. You have to knock on the door. There lives doctor. Hey, we beat the scary villagers. Please cure us. We want to be normal again. Good, thank you for saving us. I will cure you. Thank you so much. We have defeated the whole village of scary villagers. We have managed Mikey. It was a very scary adventure. Now I'm tired and ready to relax. Bye-bye.